Horned dinosaurs are a dime a dozen, but horned carnivorous dinosaurs were much, much rarer. Pop culture, we're already familiar with Carnotaurus and Ceratosaurus, both appearing at some point in the Jurassic Park movie franchise. But were there others? So let's explore seven horned carnivorous dinosaurs. Let's begin. Number seven, Proceratosaurus. Proceratosaurus is a small carnivorous theropod dinosaur, around three meters in length, from the middle Jurassic Bathonian of England. Must have drank tea. Okay, that was a shit cliche joke. It was originally thought to be an ancestor of Ceratosaurus, due to the similar small crest on its snout. Now, however, it's considered a Coelurosaur, specifically one of the earliest known members of the clad Tyrannosauridae. Number six, Geniodectus. Geniodectus, meaning jaw bite, from the Greek word genus, meaning jaw, and dectus, meaning bite, is a genus of Ceratosaurian theropod dinosaur from the Aptian stage of South America. It's known from fragments of bone, but there is a high chance it was closely related to Ceratosaurus. In 2016, it was estimated to be 6.25 meters in length and 790 kilos in weight. Number five, Draco Venator. Draco Venator is a genus of Dilophosaurid theropod dinosaur that lived approximately 200 million years ago in what is now South Africa. Draco Venator was a medium-sized, moderately built ground-dwelling bipedal carnivore that could grow up to an estimated 7 meters long. Its type specimen was based on only a partial skull that was recovered. Number 4. Cryolophosaurus Cryolophosaurus is a genus of large theropod from the early Jurassic period of Antarctica. It was around 6.5 meters long and 465 kilos in weight, making it one of the largest theropods of its time. The skull has many advanced features, leading the genus to be considered a tetanuran, an abelisaurid, a ceratosaur, and even an allosaurid. Number three, Dilophosaurus. At around seven meters in length and a weight of 400 kilos, Dilophosaurus was one of the earliest large predatory dinosaurs and the largest known land animal in North America at the time. It was slender and lightly built. The skull was proportionally large, but delicate. It had a pair of longitudinal plate-shaped crests on its skull, similar to a cassowary with two crests. In the movie Jurassic Park, it's shown to spit poison, though whether this is due to a DNA splicing error or if it was naturally supposed to possess this ability is unclear. Number two, Carnotaurus. Carnotaurus was a large theropod dinosaur that lived in South America during the late Cretaceous period. The only known species is Carnotaurus sastrae, Carnotaurus was a lightly built bipedal predator, measuring up to 9 meters in length and weighing at least 1.35 metric tons. As a theropod, Carnotaurus was highly specialized and distinctive. It had thick horns above its eyes, a feature unseen in all other carnivorous dinosaurs, and a very deep skull sitting on a muscular neck. Carnotaurus was further characterized by small vestigial forelimbs and long slender hind limbs. The skeleton is preserved with extensive skin impressions, showing a mosaic of small, non-overlapping scales approximately 5 millimeters in diameter. The mosaic was interrupted by large bumps that lined the sides of the animal. And there are no hints of feathers. Good to know. And the winner is the one that has the most prominent horn of them all, Ceratosaurus. Ceratosaurus was a medium-sized theropod. The original specimen is estimated to be 5.6 meters long, while the specimen described as C. dentisulcatus was larger at around 7 meters long. Ceratosaurus was characterized by deep jaws that supported proportionally very long blade-like teeth, a prominent ridge-like horn on the midline of the snout, and a pair of horns over the eyes. The forelimbs were very short, but remained fully functional, and the hands had four fingers, almost human. So there you have it, seven horned carnivorous dinosaurs. Dilophosaurus is a little debatable, but yeah, I mean, I had to stretch. I could even make 10. So if you know three more, please let me know in the comments below. Very tough finding these horned carnivorous dinosaurs. Stay tuned for more animations and dinosaur battles and educational material. I've been Viral Killer. Thanks for watching. Bye bye.